We're back with exclusive reporting on a recent American covert operation that targeted an Iranian vessel in the Red Sea. Three U.S. officials have told NBC News that the U.S. carried out a cyber attack on this Iranian ship that is suspected of collecting and sharing intelligence with Yemen's Houthi rebels. NBC News Pentagon correspondent Courtney Kuby joins us now from the Munich Security Conference in Germany. So, Courtney, what are we learning about how this operation and why this operation was carried out? So initially, when we were hearing about this retaliatory action that the U.S. was planning to take after the death of three U.S. service members in Jordan, we were hearing from U.S. officials that there would be the kinetic piece, so airstrikes, but there would also be a cyber component. And we're now learning a little bit more about that cyber piece. It included a cyber attack on an Iranian military vessel more than a week ago now. The goal here was to stop this vessel from being able to collect information, targeting information, that it, the Iranian military was then pres, uh, providing to the Houthi rebels. Of course, you guys know the Houthis have been firing on commercial and even military ships in the Red Sea and the Gulf of Aden for weeks now. In fact, as recently as today, they have been trying to target, target these ships. Now, the majority of their efforts with anti-ship cruise missiles, drones, and even unmanned sea vessels, or what we might call sea drones, the majority of those efforts have been unsuccessful. But they have at times been able to hit some commercial ships, at times even causing fires on board and damage to those ships. The goal with this cyber attack, according to these U.S. officials, was to stop this ability to target these ships. And according to the officials, they believe their efforts here were successful. Courtney, we actually know that Iranians had previously warned the U.S. not to attack this particular ship. What purpose are they saying it serves? To give us more information on that. And also, is the U.S. now bracing for retaliation for this attack? Yeah, so the way that this has been working is that we've seen what the, the military doesn't like to talk about it, but the reality is there has been a tit for tat here. So when there has been a strike, there has generally been a counter strike. So the U.S. is definitely concerned about the possibility for some sort of reciprocal action from Iran here. Most likely that would look like a cyber attack, but the reality is so far we've not seen anything like that. And Courtney, quickly, could we see more cyber attacks like this in response to what's happening in the Middle East? Absolutely. So I think that the reality is if they have seen this as a successful method or measure that's been able to stop the Iranians from gathering this information and share it with the Houthis, we should expect to see more of this. All right. Courtney Kuby, thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.